Good morning, guys. Bill McMillan here with NDWX.com on Sunday morning, about 9 o'clock as we record this video update for you. And we've had some wet snow move through central Indiana so far this morning. Uh, very wet, slushy type snow, and in some cases hasn't even accumulated for portions of the region. However, uh, we're not finished with this initial uh, system in what will be a series of fast-moving weather makers over the next few days. And as we put the forecast radar into motion, we notice as the Arctic air arrives this afternoon, we're going to see a growing area of snow uh, redevelop across the region. And there, within this area of snow, we'll also notice uh, some embedded, heavier, more intense bands of snow for a few hours. Uh, really from, we think, you know, backing this up, from probably between about 3 and 8 o'clock this evening, from west to east. And then we just turn bitterly cold overnight and uh, blustery as well. Now, with this uh, Arctic air arriving this afternoon, any uh, moisture that's out there on roadways is most likely going to freeze up, uh, especially on untreated surfaces, as temperatures crash uh, very quickly uh, from early to mid-afternoon. I think the cold front passes most likely somewhere between 2 and 3 o'clock locally and then temperatures will just crash in significant fashion as we progress through the afternoon and evening hours. By 8 o'clock, we're already into the lower 20s uh, or upper teens uh, based on your location across central Indiana. And as we continue to advance this, temperatures will fall uh, into the low teens by midnight. So you can see the concern certainly there for any lingering moisture to refreeze in, in significant fashion, and then you put a light uh, coating to an inch of snow on top of that. Uh, travel could be tricky in areas uh, later this evening. Something to keep in mind if you're going to be heading out to a Super Bowl party uh, later on today. Now, uh, we're still targeting an additional snowmaker to arrive in here Monday evening. After a cold, dry start to the day, clouds will lower and thicken as we go into the afternoon and evening hours, and then snow will overspread the region, uh, especially from central and northern portions of the state as we go into Monday evening into Monday night. A second uh, wave of snow will arrive Tuesday evening into Wednesday morning as an area of low pressure tracks into the Tennessee Valley and up the Appalachian chain as we go into the middle part of the week. So that's something that we're also keeping a close eye on and we'll continue to update you on uh, additional snowfall threats uh, as we go through the next couple of days. Guys, make it a great Sunday. Thank you as always for logging on to NDWX.com and we'll talk with you soon.